moment, he should be helping to fight these bomb people. Hey, any elixir left? Meanwhile, the terror continues in Little Tokyo. <laughs> Don't worry. Blowing up is good for you. Clears those arteries out. That's, That's right. right. Come on, everybody, and join hands. Watch the population explode. Oh, brother. I think if I had the same lines like those, I'd be more interested in blowing up the writer's house. Sheesh. There'll be no more exploding doughboys, though, because the good guys are here, and for the bad guys, time's up. Tell them, Speedy. We're here for the cause of freedom and the catered lunch. Let's do it! Only two of you today? Where's the other one? Holly's doing a little road work, I guess. But the two of us are enough to handle the likes of you anytime! <laughs> Mm -mm -mm -mm. You guys need an attitude adjustment. It breaks my heart, I tell you. You guys make me just want to blow up! I think you're overreacting, Captain, and it could prove to be bad for your health! Help, Schmel! Blow them to tipsy pieces! Yeah! Yeah! Hey, what the... Now we'll see what kind of superheroes you really are with a little dodgeball. All right! What am I crazy? I always got queen when we played this game. We had it now. Come on, pal. Oh, stand in front of me if they're so good. Pizza kittens, prepare to dodge. Man, these guys can throw. It's all for show. I'll catch this one. Good luck. Here's my fastball. You caught my fastball. Yeah, Speedy! Now, the paws on the other shoe. See? Whoa! That dodgeball was a bomb! Well, everybody cheats a little. This is the big leagues, after all. But since you handled my fastball so easily, we must now begin to cheat a lot. <laughs> And now, prepare to meet your doom! Speedy, flap your arms! Your pals aren't doing so well. They need help. They only need help because of you and that elixir. Drink this. Good, huh? What are you trying to do, boys and me? My feet! I can't stop! I think I hear Guido calling you, Francie. So long. <laughs> Don't forget to flap your arms. Ouch, she's going to feel that tomorrow. <laughs> Another kitty <kiddie> pig. <laughs> ah, that girl has no tolerance. Uh, ow, these sandals were built for this kind of thing. That last joke hurt you or something? Ah, my ankle. Oh. Sorry, that excuse is only good for women running in high heels from monsters in the jungle. Hey, I'm coming through! Is that Francine? <laughs> what? Well, so much for dodgeball. Try another game! All right! Huddle up, everyone! This doesn't look good. We are youth! And youth is for explosion! Boom! Pizza cat, meet Bomb Perignon! That's one big boy, and I'm not talking hamburgers! The only lunch meat here will be us if that thing decides to explode. I may be too close for comfort myself. Hey! Bomb old pal! Trample them tomcat! What is that you're humming? <laughs> Cat smash fever! Will this be the end for our heroes? Will they be? Wait a minute, there's still four minutes left. That music can only mean one thing. That polyester, the gallant and glamorous feline crime fighter has come in the nick of time. Hey! Pretty Polly was busy, but you guys needed help, so... It's Guru Lu, come to save the day. And I'm cuter than Polly anyway. Hey, not bad! 
Oh, brother, who is this bucket head? <laughs> You're gonna be sorry you said that. Here I come. No. So much for our rescuer. Maybe he's gonna tunnel under and come up from behind. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Or maybe we really had it. Now you have three targets. Stamp them out, Bomb Perigno. I got him, Guido. I'll... That's okay. Watch this. You overgrown spud, I'll teach you. <laughs> Guido! Don't worry there, Speedy. I think I hear our secret weapon coming. Somebody help! help! Mm -hmm. Just watch what happens when she gets here. Beat it, beat it. What? Oh, oh, oh. Somebody stop me! Ah! Ah! Bum, 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 bum. Time now to polish off this Humpty Dumpty monster with the Ginzo sword! <laughs> You've seen it all before, fans, and you're seeing it again. A swirling pink flame, the convenient pop top stabbed. As Speedy unsees the magical Ginzo Sword. Put some ice on my ankle. Ta da! You bah! Those kids are worthless! They're worthless, worthless, worthless! <laughs> oh, dancing! One of my favorite youthful activities. Mind if I join you? By all means, come right on in, Captain. Bad move, remember? <laughs> They're all fired. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> So you're Dr. Whammy, and you sent that bottle of cure to the pizza parlor to help us. Yeah, because yeah. you knew if Polly drank it, Francine and Lucille would too, and we'd end up needing both of them at the last second to save us from blowing up with people. <laughs> Boy, are these two stupid. I guess we ought to thank you. <laughs> I just did what any red-blooded citizen with a bottle of magic energy elixir and half a brain cell would have done. So tell me, Lou, how long do you think those girls will be running? They'll come to a stop when the elixir wears off. They'll be a little thinner, though. And while they're gone, we can play cards all night! And eat all the pizza! And leave all the dishes in the sink for days and days without Francine yelling about it. Say, Lou, maybe you ought to whip up another batch of elixir, just in case. And so another of Big Jesus' desperately plots is foiled by Speedy Ceviche, whose ankle healed up nicely, thank you, and his intrepid band of crime-fighting kitties. But wait, isn't something missing from this saga? Where's Bad Bird and all of these shenanigans? Hiding out under a waterfall? When I find the therapist that recommended this, I'm gonna charge him for a whole new leather outfit. First, those cats are gonna meet the new Bad Bird. Will the healing waters make Bad Bird invincible? Or will they just kind of shrink his little leather outfit and make him crabby? Ladies and gentlemen, the 